Hello creative people, SAS explainer videos don't have to just be your style in this way and there is nothing wrong with trying to make them your own but you are confused as to how to take them to that next level. Today I am going to provide you with 5 text animation styles that are considered top notch and are used in SAS explanations to push your promo campaigns to that next level. And the best news, I am also providing you with free presets to create your text animations. So without further ado, enjoy and make sure you watch until the end. So firstly, let's go with our first text animation uh, so first layer is our background layer and the next is our text layer so firstly let's see our text animation first so our text animation will look like this so what we have done just select your text layer expand the text layer properties expand the text and here you can see two animators so basically just go to animate and just add the first animator for position and opacity let's break down this animator so expand the first animator which is basically consisting of of position property opacity property and the blur property basically three properties are included to make this animation so uh, just i have dragged the vertical position of the text to around 34 percent i have dragged the opacity to all around to zero percent and just increase the blur amount to something around 13 to 15 between 13 to 15 percent okay so our text animation will like now the magic is in the range selector expand the range selector property and just animate the offset from negative 100 to 100 and expand the advanced property and hit here just set the based on two words and just play with the settings of ease high and ease low and change the shape to ramp up and you are done now let's go with our next animator which is basically animator 2 and on this animator i have added a fill color property just go to animate go to fill color and just select rgb and your property will be added and now you can you are free to choose any color you like i have used the dark bluish tone and here expand the range selector and just animate the off offset property to from negative 100 to 100 and in the advanced just set the based on to characters during spaces and change change the shape to ramp up just play with the settings of ease high and ease low and your final text animation will look like this and just turn on the motion blur for the most realistic feel for your text animations so yeah and now on this text i have added a simple effect called warp effect uh, basically i have animated the bend property from 100 to 0 and 0 to 100 so you can see uh, you can see the warp style set to fish eye and just animate the bend from 100 to 0 so our text animation will finally look like this so yeah this was our first text animation in the sas explanation style okay now let's go to our next text which is the sas text 2 and just as previous our background layer and now our next text layer so just select your text expand the text layer properties expand the text and now here you can see the animator 2 and the cursor blink effect so basically i have applied the typewriter effect which is default in after effect you can just randomly type typewriter and you can see the blinking cursor typewriter console you can apply this effect to your main text layer and also i have just copy and paste the previous effect which is the fill color effect you, you can go to animate just go to fill color and just click on rgb and choose your desired color and the range selector just animate the offset property and in the advanced just change the base down to characters excluding spaces and change the shape to ramp up and just play with the settings of is high and is low and finally your animation will look like this and on the effects controls it will automatically you when you will apply the typewriter console effect all these effects will pop up in the effect controls panel and just don't forget to turn on the motion blur for the realistic feel just let's see our text animation second so yeah this text is mostly used in sas explanation in most of the promo styles okay so yeah now let's go with our next text with a sas text 3 animation so let's select your text layer expand the text layer properties expand the text and here you can see two animators again just the second animator is the previous as like rain selector and the fill color effect just go to animate go to fill color and select the rgb effect and now for the animator 1 let's quickly turn off or just close this animator 2 expand the animator 1 properties and here also i have used 
three properties like position opacity and blur for the position i have set the horizontal position to 49 to the left and the opacity set to zero and the blur amount set to around 21 percent okay and in the range selector expand just animate the offset property from negative 100 to 100 and in the advanced just change the based based on to words and change the shape to ramp up and just play with the setting of is high is low for the most smooth smoother feel for your text okay so our text animation will look like this okay now let's go to our fourth text animation let's see our text animation yeah select your text just expand the text layer properties expand the text and here you can see the two animator again just expand the first animator too which is a previous like color animation this is optional you can use according to your preferences but this is the most used animation in the sas explainer promos the range selector for the color effect okay you are free to choose any color you want just close this animator too and expand the animator three properties and here you can see the four properties or you can see three three properties maybe let's see for the first property is the position property i have set the horizontal property to negative 71 and change the opacity to zero percent all around to zero percent and just change the tracking amount to negative 19 okay and now the magic is in the range selector expand the range selector property and just animate the offset from zero to 100 and in the advanced property just change the base down to words and change the shape to square and just play with the settings of is high and is low okay just close this and make sure to turn on the motion blur for the more realistic feel and our text animation finally look like this okay perfect now the last and least our text animation the fifth text animation so basically i have added two lines for the text the first line is the you should promote using ai and the second line is the managing a creative agency so basically i would have done just expand the first layer expand the text and just here you can see two animators the first animator is obviously a color animator this is optional again i'm telling you this is optional you are free to uh, choose uh, any color you like or uh, animator you like and now for the animator three options let's go to animator three and just i have uh, basically i have added the position opacity and the blur property i have set the position to vertical 30 and the set the opacity all around zero percent and set the blur amount to 16 now the magic is in the range selector again just animate the property from negative 100 to 100 and in the advanced property just change them based on to lines and change the shape to ramp up and just play with the settings of is high and is low okay and now the same setting are done with the second text line you can see managing a creative agency the difference is that i have offset the second layer which is the below layer i have offset the layer second layer a little frames forward so our first line comes first and the second line comes after that okay so you can see our first finally text animation just turn on the motion blur for the realistic feel now our text animation will look like this comes like this and go, it goes back to its normal position so basically what you have to do is just select both the text layer hit you to see the keyframes basically at last you have to offset the keyframes first so you have to offset the keyframe for the second line first and the first line afterwards so what you have to do is just select these last two keyframes and just drag here first and select the last two keyframes of the first layer and just drag it two frames forward so it will offset in the end too like this okay perfect select your text hit u to hide all the keyframes and now these were our finally text animations okay and that is a wrap those were the top five text animations to instantly level up your sas explainer videos you will find the link to download all the free presets right in the description below if this video helped you make sure to follow me on instagram for daily motion design tips breakdowns and behind the scenes content and if you like to support what i do and get access to exclusive content and deeper tutorials you can join my patreon page it costs less than a meal but it makes a huge difference and help me keep these tutorials free for the community thanks a lot for watching keep creating stay curious and i will see you in the next one